Uh, today I'm going to be teaching you how to properly grip and throw a baseball. And it's probably, you're thinking, just grab the baseball and throw it, but there's actually a lot more to it. Um, so at a younger age, we uh, teach our kids to throw the ball with the four seam. And why it's called a four seam is because anywhere on the ball, your two fingers will always be on four seams. Um, and what this helps is your last finger off the ball will be your middle finger and uh, it'll keep it straight uh, to your target or to uh, the bag, whoever you're throwing to. A common mistake is most young players grab a two seam and what a two seam is, wherever your fingers are, are on the ball, it will always be on two seams. Um, and you're probably wondering what's the difference between the two. Like I said with the four seam, your middle finger is the last finger to come off the ball and with the two seam, what it does is your index finger will be the last one off, and as you throw, your arm will naturally pronate, so when it comes off, it'll run to your arm side, whether you're right-handed or left-handed. Um, so along with that, I'll teach you the footwork uh, with shoulder work, arm work, all of that. My right leg will be uh, my base, so I'll, I'll step, and my left leg will be my step leg, and it'll, uh, I'll step towards my target. So when I step towards my target, I wanna have my foot aiming at my target. So um, as I get ready to throw and I get my step, I want my, my ball facing away from me. And you're probably asking why that is. Um, whenever it's facing towards you, you don't have any power or accuracy behind it. Um, because when it's away from you, you can turn your body but once the ball is facing towards you, you don't have any turn and you won't have any power or accuracy behind it. The question is asked, how to pitch or throw a baseball? Basically, when you attempt to throw a baseball, you want to have the, the ball and the glove and your hands together. You're gonna to step directly towards the target with your left foot if you're right-handed, right straight at your target. The toe is more or less pointed at, that, at the target. You're gonna separate your hands to a point where that your elbows are about even with your shoulders with the palms out. That's very important. You don't want palms up or palms in, you want palms out. We don't want palms up or palms in, but palms out. As you attempt to throw the baseball toward your target, you will pull with your left side in the glove and throw the ball uh, in a manner so that you lead with your elbow to your target and make sure you follow through. You, um, you want to have the four seam grip because it'll allow your ball to go straight to your target and if you hold the two seam um, it'll run away from your target and you always want it going straight um, whichever say I'm right-handed so my right foot will be my base and my left foot will be my step vice versa if you're left-handed <laughs>